Welcome to Shield Spectrum. Today, we'll explore how to safely use the dark web and search for information without exposing our identity. There are several search engines on the dark web that help make searching easier. Among them, the hidden wiki is one of the most popular tools. It allows you to find your target information, although it might take some time and effort. But remember, there's hardly anything that doesn't exist on the dark web. Everything is there. However, while using it, it's crucial to maintain your anonymity. Otherwise, you might get lost in the dark web yourself. In this video, I'll show you exactly how to access the dark web and set up your system for safe exploration. Let's get started. Disclaimer, this video is made for educational purposes only. We do not encourage or promote any illegal activity. First, open any browser and search for Tails OS. The official Tails website will appear at the top of the search results. From the homepage, click on Install Tails. Then, scroll down a bit and under Other Options, click on Burning a Tails DVD. Because we'll be using this ISO file to install Tails OS in VirtualBox. Now, click on Download Tails 6.16 ISO image and the download will begin automatically. After the download is complete, open VirtualBox. Then click on New to create a new virtual machine. Here, give your operating system a name I'm naming it Tails OS. Now, add the ISO image file you just downloaded. You can either skip unattended installation, or leave it as is, both options will work. Then, click Next to continue. Now, set the base memory to around 4 gigabytes. And for the processor, allocate two CPU cores for better performance. If you plan to do heavier tasks, then set the hard disk size to 50 gigabytes for better performance. Once everything is set up, simply click Start to launch your Tails OS virtual machine. The main reason for using Tails OS is that it runs entirely on RAM, not your hard drive. This makes it extremely difficult for anyone to track you, even if they try. It's built for privacy. And that's why almost every hacker uses Tails OS to safely access the dark web. It also ensures strong anonymity throughout the session. From here, you can click the plus icon, plus, to set a password if you want. Or you can simply click on Start Tails to launch the operating system directly. Tails OS automatically connects to the Tor network, so your internet traffic becomes encrypted and anonymous from the moment you go online. No extra setup needed. It may take a little time to connect to the Tor network, so please be patient during the process. When you click on the Start Tor button, the Tor browser will launch automatically. This means you don't need to open it manually. It gets ready for you to start browsing right away. From here, you can begin exploring the dark web safely and anonymously. For double protection, you can also set up a VPN before connecting to Tor. These are the must-have extensions you should definitely use for maximum security and privacy. No script. Blocks potentially dangerous scripts, JavaScript, Flash, etc. that can compromise your security or reveal your identity. Comes pre-installed and enabled in Tor browser. Never turn it off. Ublock Origin. A reliable ad and tracker blocker that also protects against malware domains. Lightweight and effective for keeping your browsing clean and safe. Privacy Badger. Developed by the EFF, it automatically learns to block invisible trackers. HTTPS Everywhere. Automatically forces websites to use encrypted HTTPS connections, ensuring your data stays private and secure. These three extensions form the core of your dark web security setup. Without them, your privacy and safety could be at serious risk. Now, open your browser and go to http colon slash slash privacy .net slash analyzer to start testing your privacy settings. After setting up your browser with privacy extensions, use a privacy analyzer tool to test your security. These tools check if your IP is hidden, trackers are blocked, and your connection is secure. Some popular tools are Panopticlick, Browser Leaks, and Am I Unique? Running these tests helps ensure your browser keeps you anonymous and safe on the dark web. Basic info. Collects general details like browser type, OS, screen size, 
and language. Autofill leak test. Checks if autofill data, like name, email, can be leaked without permission. User account tests. Detects if you are logged into services like Google or Facebook in your browser. Browser capability test. Tests which browser features you support, JavaScript, cookies, WebGL, etc. Fingerprint analysis. Uses unique browser and device traits to track you across sites. When you visit http colon slash slash www.doyleak.com, it redirects you to top 10 VPN's website where they offer various privacy and security tests to check how much of your personal and device info leaks online. IP address leak, DNS leak test, WebRTC leak test, IPv6 leak test, location info, browser information, autofill leak test, cookie test, fingerprinting test, user account status. This site is mainly used to check privacy leaks that might reveal your identity or data even when using VPNs or privacy tools. When you visit dnsleaktest.com, the website shows your current IP address. If you are using Tor browser, it will display your Tor exit nodes IP instead of your real IP. This helps you verify that your real IP is hidden and only the Tor network IP is visible. If you're finding this video helpful and want more content like this, hit the subscribe button and stay with us. Now we'll begin searching the dark web using specialized search engines. Among the most popular ones, Amia stands out. It's widely used by ethical hackers and researchers to find leaked data or hidden information on the dark web. Let's try searching for something sensitive using a dark web search engine. For example, if we type Gmail Combo Dump 2025 into a search engine like Amia, we may come across leaked databases that claim to contain Gmail addresses and passwords from recent data breaches. These dumps are usually stored on .onion sites and sometimes shared in hacker forums. However, accessing or using this data is illegal and unethical. This demonstration is purely for educational awareness. Another powerful dark web search engine is Torch. It's one of the oldest and most widely used onion search engines. However, keep in mind that Torch can sometimes be offline, depending on server status or network load. With Torch, you can find various types of hidden content such as leaked databases, hacking forums and services, illegal marketplaces for educational awareness only, whistleblower platforms, fake document vendors, pirated software and crack tools, anonymous chat rooms and underground communities. Torch does not censor results, which means it indexes a wide range of .onion links, both legal and illegal. Always remember to access such content responsibly, and only for educational and ethical research purposes. If you search for dark web hacking on Amia, you may find hacking forums, leak tools and exploits, Tutorials on illegal activities Services offering to hack accounts Links to data breach dumps But be careful, most of these are illegal, risky, and often contain malware. Use this information only for education and awareness. If we search the same term, dark web hacking forum, on DuckDuckGo's Onion version, we might also find Hacking-related .onion site links dark web forums and blogs, pastebin style sites with leaked info, links to marketplaces and hacking tools, onion directories like hidden wiki. However, DuckDuckGo may filter some illegal content, so results are often cleaner compared to other dark web search engines. To find leaked government data for a specific country, just type the country name plus keywords like gov data leak in the search engine. For example, Country plus gov data leak will show leaks related to country. Use this info responsibly and only for education. If you search CCTV feed onion on Torch, you might find links to exposed or unsecured CCTV camera feeds, direct streams from vulnerable cameras worldwide, forums discussing camera hacks, tools for accessing surveillance systems. However, currently Torch is offline so searching now won't return any results. Remember, accessing or using these feeds is illegal and unethical. This information is shared only for awareness and education. 
If you search CCTV feed onion on Amia, you might find links to unsecured or exposed CCTV camera feeds. Onion sites sharing surveillance streams. Forums discussing camera vulnerabilities and hacks. Searching Marketplace Onion shows links to darknet markets selling various items, including illegal goods. Now, let's see how to find information using the Hidden Wiki. Hidden Wiki is a popular directory of .onion sites on the dark web. You can browse categories like forums, marketplaces, hacking, and more. It's a good starting point to explore and find target information safely. Always stay anonymous and cautious while browsing. Inside the Hidden Wiki, in the introduction section, you'll find links to popular dark web search engines such as Amia, DuckDuckGo, Onion Version, Tor Link Directory, Torch, Onion Link Lists, the Hidden Wiki itself. Hidden Wiki's anonymity and security section has tips for using Tor and Tails safely, VPN setup guides, how to avoid tracking and fingerprinting, in the Onion Link section, you'll find different categories like Introduction Points Financial Services Commercial Services Drugs Chan's Image Boards Privacy Services Email Providers Blogs and Personal Sites Hacking Resources News Sites Open Source Software Others These categories help you navigate various types of hidden services safely. In the Hidden Wiki Self-Defense section, you'll find resources focused on Digital Security Tips Guides for Protecting Your Online Privacy The Tor Links section includes Direct links to popular .onion websites Marketplaces and forums Security and hacking resources Communication tools like anonymous email and chat Cryptocurrency services News and blogs Darknet versions of popular sites. Tor Project. The New York Times Secure Drop. Deutsche Welle. BBC News. Proton Mail. Dark Web has many blogs, essays, and news sites sharing independent journalism. Dark Web offers anonymous email and secure messaging services for private communication. Social networks and forums for anonymous chatting and community discussions. There are whistleblowing platforms website hosting and development, file uploaders, software engineers consultancy, Bitcoin mining, crypto and blockchain services, audio radios on tour, videos, movies, TV, games, books, drugs, and many more items. In financial services, you'll find hidden wallets, PayPal Bazaar, cash machines, and more. Hidden Wallet, a secure, Anonymous cryptocurrency wallet used to store and transfer digital currencies privately. PayPal Bazaar, a marketplace or service that mimics PayPal transactions for buying and selling goods, often anonymously. Cash Machine, services or devices for converting cryptocurrencies into cash or vice versa, sometimes linked to ATMs or exchangers on the dark web. Commercial Services Domain Services Onion name refers to the unique .onion address used to access hidden services on the dark web. Under anonymity and security, many use fake ID generators to protect their identity and stay anonymous. Buying, selling, and managing darknet domains .onion sites involves handling hidden websites while keeping identity private. Privacy-focused domain services help protect owner details. Fake ID generators create false identification documents to help users stay anonymous and avoid detection. Skynet Anonymous Ecology site is currently offline. BBC News, a major international news broadcaster providing global news coverage. Deutsche Welle, Germany's international public broadcaster offering news and information worldwide. The New York Times Secure Drop a secure platform that allows whistleblowers to anonymously share information with journalists from the New York Times. File Uploaders SecureDrop allows secure and anonymous sharing and receiving of documents, often used by journalists and whistleblowers. Bitcoin, Monero, Crypto and Blockchain Gridcoin notarized documents with the Gridcoin blockchain. Free 
BISC BISC is a decentralized Bitcoin exchange network that enables secure, private and censorship-resistant exchange of Bitcoin for national currencies and other cryptocurrencies over the Internet. Crypto 740 t Prediction Market Tor and Monero Usage Awareness 0xB10C Bitcoin Developer Blog I work full-time on open-source Bitcoin projects. Explorer Bitcoin Blockchain Explorer Explorer lets you track Bitcoin transactions, view wallet histories, and check block details anonymously but transparently. Book archives like the Imperial Library of Tranter with nearly a million books, and the Comic Book Library with over 2,400 comics. Explore everything step by step like this, and you'll gradually get a clear idea. But to find your target information, you'll need to search a lot. To stay safe, never download anything unwanted. Only use the dark web for research or searching purposes. For more tutorials like this, make sure to subscribe and stay with us. And if you liked the video, don't forget to like and comment. Thanks for watching.